Hey, Donna Filippiak here, and I just had a thought uh, about uh, your thinking and the words that you say. And we all know that how you think and how you speak can affect uh, your life for the better or for the worse. So I thought of this story, and I don't even know where it came from because it's a long time ago. This was when my daughter was, was a little a baby, and she is now a mom uh, herself. So it was many years ago. But at this time, my life was not bad. I had a baby, you know, I was married, I was happy. And so I'm not sure where all this, this negativity came from, but I was, I was out with my mom and her boyfriend. And my mom's boyfriend was probably one of the most laid back men I've ever met. Never had any bad thing to say. The only time he would say something is if it really, really bothered him. And then he might make a comment. So we were at this place, like it was like a Sea World or some other place where there was just a lot of people. And I was complaining, I guess I was complaining about the people. I was complaining about our seats. I was complaining about the weather. And I think it was just like one thing after another. I wasn't even aware I was doing it. It just was coming out that way. And I heard him say to my mom, do you think she could shut up and stop complaining? Or something, I mean, maybe not quite that, that um, nasty, but he, he, he said something like that. And when I heard it, it was like he slapped me across the face. That's how bad it hurt. Because I knew that when he said something like that, it was bad. It made me stop right there and say, okay, I'm not gonna complain again for the rest of the day, at least. And I think it was the start of my realizing how your words and your thoughts affect your life. And that was, I was pretty young. I was, you know, 20, 21. And now I'm not saying that I'll, you know, I never complained again or I never had a negative thought again. That, that would be a lie. I have. And, and I still do every now and then. But what I found out was it's not all just about me. My thoughts, my negativity, not, it affects everyone around me. It was affecting my mom and it was affecting her boyfriend. And it was probably affecting the people that were within earshot of me, probably wanting me to shut up too. So, you know, so, so stop when you, when, when, you, when you are thinking, when you're talking, just stop for a minute and think, was that a negative, you know, comment? How could I say that differently? What I, what I do sometimes is, I started doing, was, was thinking back at my last few conversations that I've had in my, my friends and family, coworkers, and, and thinking about, was it negative? Was it positive? Did they seem to want to just get away from me because they couldn't take anymore? Because I've been around people like that. And, you know, and if I'm finding that I'm more negative than positive, then I stop. Because, I don't want to cause other people, you know, to feel bad. I want to feel good myself, and I want everyone around me to feel good. I, I would love for me to be able to inspire everybody. You know, I know it's not possible, but I would love to be an inspiration to everyone. So here's what I just wanted you to know. I just wanted you to make, realize, if you haven't already realized this, how powerful your thoughts and your words are not only to just you and your life, but to everyone around you. So start thinking positive and speaking positive and watch your whole world change. That is a promise. So thanks for listening and I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.